Friends of our Blessed Lady, this week we take a closer look at the second of our seven windows in our main sanctuary. It represents the cardinal virtue of justice. For a description of this virtue, go to the link that accompanies this video. The angel is holding a scale that we often see displayed on courtroom buildings. The sword in the angel's right hand reminds us of Jesus' words, I have come not to bring peace, but a sword. The sword of God's word separates the just from the unjust. George Whelan offers this reflection on the cardinal virtue of justice. We can perhaps summarize the description of justice by using the adage, do unto others as you would have them do to you. Justice is related to others. We are not to be judgmental, harsh, or arbitrary in our dealing with others. We are to be fair and respectful. Fairness is a challenge at those times when some people are unfair to us. Yet we are instructed by our Lord to turn the other cheek rather than to be unjust in response. We should note that our Lord even forgave his executioners from his cross. Let us pray to have the strength and kindness to be just at all times. We pray, Mary, help us to be just in all our dealings with our fellow human beings here on earth. May we be models of firm justice to all, so as to spread the example of Jesus here on earth. We ask this through the same Christ, our Lord. Amen. In our next reflection, we will focus on the third of our seven sanctuary windows. It depicts the theological virtue of faith. Thank you, dear friends, for your patronage, and especially for your devotion to Mary. May you always remain close to our Blessed Lady. O Mary, conceived without sin, pray for us who have recourse to you.